Hello Aquarius and welcome to your love, lust, or loss reading. This is for Aquarius. All right, Aquarius, let's see what is going on. What does Aquarius need to know? What does Aquarius need to know? Love, lust, or loss. Let's see. We have pleasure. I crave you, I taste you, I feel you, I will give you ecstasy. So that's pretty intense. Um, clearly, someone is very attracted to you, but I just don't know if you're feeling what they're feeling, okay? But if given the chance... <laughs> they they'll do uh whatever it takes here all right let's see what is going on this is for aquarius what does aquarius need to know love life, or loss a few cards for them a few cards for you and then the outcome this resonates with you Aquarius please like share and subscribe leave me a comment I would greatly appreciate it if this does not resonate with you at all Aquarius please do check your moon your rising and your Venus sign as this will not resonate with every Aquarius out there cross watchers please keep in mind that some of the energies can be vice versa interchangeable so however it resonates with you this is for aquarius love lust or loss for aquarius let's see okay i don't even think uh you are even really noticing this person too much at the moment okay so hmm. I, I feel like this is you over here I feel like you're dealing with a lot right now um, maybe you're dealing with some drama you're trying to stay very focused and grounded like on work and everything um, and just kind of doing your doing your Aquarius thing at the moment you're looking down, you're focused on other things. You do not see this person over here kind of going batshit crazy over you, but they are. And they're getting ready to make some bold statements. So um, I, I just don't think you know, you really notice them, which is interesting. But boy, are they noticing you. So they are getting, um, let's say, we got this Aries energy. You could be dealing with an Aries or somebody with Aries in their chart. They're getting their power up. All right. They're getting their confidence at a level that it's going to take to get you to see them. Because I feel like they've been doing certain things it's not bold enough it's not bold enough they're getting ready to get real bold real quick all right so um you you need to start looking around you need to start looking around seeing who's around you big big moves this person's getting ready to make um they're getting ready to express what they want here but it's not only i mean they are very turned on by you that's very clear here however they're very serious about the situation this is someone that's been around you you just don't see them they're getting ready to make their move the the real move not just kind of hinting around and you know maybe being friendly with you or whatever you could be dealing with a cancer or somebody with cancer in their chart here. So this is someone that you um, is in your circle somehow, some way, whether it's, you know, like a 
work acquaintance or uh, friendly type situation. Um, this is group, okay? And they don't want to be your friend. <laughs> no. They want to be your lover. Okay, three of cups. Here's the move, a lot of movement. They got to be big. They got to be bold. They got to like get in your face and say, Aquarius, I want you. And that is how, I feel like that's how they, they're going to need to do it. You're, you're so focused on like other people's shit and your work and all these things. You yourself are going to have to use your intuition. Um, when it comes to this person, all right? But they are so serious about you. So movement, movement, movement. It's going to be, I feel like it's going to kind of uh, throw you for a loop here. Six of swords. So like I said, this is you over here. You're dealing with a bunch of drama. You're trying to stay focused on work. You're trying to get everything lined up. Like you're getting your life lined out and dealing with a bunch of chaos at the moment. Now this doesn't necessarily have to be love related. This could just be a bunch of people causing drama in your life. And th these are the things that you've been focused on, right? So five of wands and then we got the eight of pinnacles and then we got the high priestess here. So I feel like this person is almost stealth-like, okay? They come in under the radar. They do certain things, they say certain things. Um, maybe, maybe some of you are picking up a little bit of a vibe here, but for the most part, uh, Aquarius, you're busy. You're, you're busy to notice exactly what's going on here because it's all they're trying to hide it, right? The high priestess protects her secrets. You are going to have to use your intu intuition to navigate this because I'm not 100% sure you're interested in, in, in them. But they are most definitely interested in you. We got the Ace of Wands here. We got the Knight of Swords and we got the World card. So this person is ready for their next chapter in their life which is great. Um, they have to be more um, in your face. They have to be more bold to get you to even see them. Um, Ace of Wands, self-explanatory here. Uh, a lot of chemistry, a lot of attraction, right? As we all know. The, or most of us, um, the Ace of Wands is a very phallic card. If you don't know what that means, you can look it up. I always have to say that. But they're getting ready to tell you the truth of how much they want you, but they literally have to get you to focus on them. That's what I want to say. So Ace of Wands, Knight of Swords, and the World card. The outcome, look at this. Ace of Pentacles, the Hierophant, and the Queen of Pentacles. This person, I feel like they've been, first of all, they've been trying to express their interest in everyday practical ways. Um, doing just little things um, to get you to notice them, that's not working. Um, but they are very serious about you. It's not only this lust that's going on, but they're very serious when it comes to you. Ace of Pentacles, the Hierophant, the Queen of Pentacles. You'd be dealing with an earth sign, clearly Taurus energy here with the Hierophant. So um, if you are willing to accept their offer, they're going to put it in your lap and they're praying for the best. They're praying for the best over here. But this this person is real. Um, this person will do anything um, to capture your heart. And um, 
they're they're hoping you give them a fighting chance here really so love lust or loss for aquarius cray it's super lusty <laughs> super lust if you want this this is somebody that you could spend the rest of your life with but you you have to see them first right you have to take notice um so interesting interesting we'll we'll see how it all pans out and of course what you want all right aquarius that's what's going on i hope that resonates with some of you most of you all of you you can now follow me on all the socials i'll leave those links down below in the description box you guys have a beautiful day and a great week and i will talk to you soon take care and god bless